Gotta be careful with the exposure on this, cause you can really overexpose if you're not careful. Say hi, baby. Hi, Daddy. Hi, Elizabeth. Get out, Get out, Watch this angle. Get out, Very upset because I just realized that I didn't bring my my camera, oh, the man. one that makes single images, not the continuous. Contiguous 48 images. I can see you got half the battery. Yep. And you're 39 minutes and 8 seconds on that tape. Well, backwards because I think it just started to see it. Oh, Sony's tape. All that Sony stuff, they got it now. How about that uh, info lithium battery system? It's pretty niftified. Is that just high 8 or is that digital 8? It's just high 8. That's still great, man. You can get those cheap, too. Yep. And I like shooting in the uh, 16.9. Yeah. This frame is better. You know? Makes you also feel like you're making a real movie. You're making a film. A film, yeah, that's what I meant. Uh oh. Oh my god. You're not what? Air conditioning vent? Broken hanging out. What happened? Our house is so nice and cool. Wonderful. Must be a wicked storm coming. Hey, baby. Hi. Uh, what is so funny? You fired up? <laughs> no, you don't pick that thing up. <laughs> Something might crawl Ray out from underneath it. Oh, God. Oh, when Ray got, got it. Dead rat pie. <laughs> Ray got it. It had skeletons and mice in it. And I didn't know it. And I really? took the water hose and filled it up. I rinsed it out. And then I took the water hose and... Sprayed up in there sprayed and stuff? Sprayed in there and left it sitting and then I went to dump them out and all these little oh. mice that was dehydrated could now are filled out. You could tell what they were. A whole yeah. bunch of them. Wow. So they nasty. go in there small and they grow up and can get out. Well, yeah, they, they went in there small but they tried to get out too, I'm sure when they're small they couldn't climb up the top. Wow, oh, that's interesting. I don't know. It's old and give out. He's old and give out. Can't dance. Yes, can't. All right, Dan. I don't know how to dance. Well, Captain, what you, you got to say about I it? I haven't shaved in about three days, boy. I ain't felt like it. I ain't had time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know what you're saying. I've just been busy. It's stuff to do. Things yeah, to do. Things to do, and then have to take a break between times and, and kick my old foot up. And, well, you're gonna have to have to kind of stuff. calm it down a little bit. Don't let yourself get too. Too overexerted. Yeah, well, it's just lasting longer this time. It, it's been like this before, but mm -hmm. I said if it's not better by Monday morning, 10, 11 o'clock, it's still exactly the same. I'm gonna wait and call the doctor and get on that nasty medicine. Yeah, I don't want to do it, but I I gotta get this foot down. I can't I can't, can't have it like that. I can't. What I'm doing, what I'm doing isn't working. What I'm doing is not working. Yeah, it's pretty uncomfortable looking. Yeah. What I'm doing is not working. It did in the past. That's Yankee for paste. Paste. But it's not working now. I'm doing everything I'm supposed to do. Well, that's not good. But. <laughs> It will get better if I have to go to the doctor and get on that stuff. I don't want to take it, but I will. Get it. Well, I ain't gonna take it. it. As soon as it gets well, I'm gonna quit taking the medicine. I ain't gonna go on taking it. Get you in a two shot. I put that out there because when you first light it, the flames come up and I don't want to mess with this. But after, I mean, it starts sprinkling rain, it'll pick it up. Yep. I 
got a couple of bass with the lake instead of some patties. That's good for steaks where you cut stuff like that too. But it's uh, chopped or something. But when I got it to the lake, it's just the same on both sides. In other words, if you turn that over, your meat's not close to the fire. Yeah. Okay, when, when I went out there to open up my old pit and start getting ready to bring it over here and use it, they had, yeah, well, they had red ones, oh, had them on this God. about this big, and they already started, and there's four of them in there, and they act like they're a little pissed, so. <laughs> so how'd you kill them? swatted them. No, I didn't kill them. I just got you them out. You swatted them? I haven't swatted them. with my bare hand. hand. I swatted them with my hand. Some of his bare hand. Man, I, I had, I knocked me two nests yesterday down in my house. I had my can. I was ready to go up and down the street and ask people, could I go in your backyard and just look around and see if you got wasps? Because I love to kill them. <laughs> I do, man. I get my jollies. You I, I, always I, like killing if bees. If that shit was fifty dollars a can, I'd still buy it. <laughs> You've always loved killing bees. I remember you out here with a with a badminton racket or a tennis racket, hitting them slow bees and big old fat dumb yeah, slow they don't bees. Yeah, they, they don't even sting it. That was kind of kind of cruel, but. Oh boy, the ones that sting you, you're just happy to murder them. Yeah, that was almost not as good. I had, did I tell you when we were, we were in London and we, we just crossed, know, we, we, we took the tube to, to uh, Westminster Station? Yeah. And uh, you, you don't realize it, but you go under the Thames when you do that. Right. And uh, we came out on the other side and we crossed back over Westminster Bridge from, from Big Ben and crossed over to the museums and to where the... Uh, Airways, British Airways London Eye is, yeah. observation wheel. And right when we got across the bridge, there were some guys handing out pamphlets. You know, it was a real crowded street. And they were right. handing out pamphlets to go, are you going to the museum, you're going to the museum, if you go to the museum. And this guy, like, I had it my most recent, the one we saw him in Dallas, Elvis in Dallas, the green okay. yeah, long yeah. sleeve. And he was, no, it wasn't that. No, it couldn't have been that. It was the black one. It was the, uh, I got it in Austin. I paid like 50 bucks for it. But it's a nice button. It's embroidered, it's Elvis Costello, the yeah. attractions, uh, all this useless beauty. Tour. Yeah. That's the barbecue, Dave. And uh, so it says the attractions. This guy was like, if you go in the, oh, wow. Elvis Costello in the attractions. I was like, thanks. <laughs> it just like caught him. I was like, wow. Like you'd never seen anything. Before. I was like, and I almost, you know, was tempted to stop and go, "Oh, you, you dig this? See, I'm, I live in Texas. How cool am I?" What's his name? But well, you're cool for living in Texas in general. Because like, if after, only you knew. After, yeah, after Don't a day or two, we were dying Ray. to talk to locals. We were That's dying, his name, we baby. Were dying it's to hook okay. Up with locals, we were just dying to. But you know, it's like we tried. This, there were some young guys drinking in a pub, and we were drinking, and we were. We were like, man, I wish we'd go hang out with them. I know it sounds so gay. <laughs> I want to go hang out with them, man, and get to know them. And but you didn't. Well, we kind of did. This one guy who was getting more drunk than any of them, yeah. his name was Albie. And, uh, and he, as he drank, it, it became apparent that he had some type of MS. Yeah. And uh, he was drinking. I ran into him on the way to the oh, bathroom. He, had dr he dropped his drink, and, you know, it's his pint glasses, and they just shatter like crazy, and they're ready to clean it up. And they're being real polite. Not even ready to kick him out like they would here at a bar, you know, yeah. kind of getting that trashed. And, and there, everywhere you go, you know, you go into public places, and it's, it's, it's like totally, you can't do it. It's totally unheard of. You're not supposed to, like, speak out loud. You can't, like, raise your voice. Yeah. Only, the only place you can is in a pub. And that's yeah. where it's like expected. You'll, you'll hear him getting loud, like, that <laughs> guy was in a fucking football game, and I was in the. Did you get a baseball fight at me? Fuck it out, man. Fuck it out, man. You know, and they're, they're all just doing it. It's the it. only place you can actually do an Aussie right. impersonation, I'm just wondering. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's all. The reason why they're like overly loud in the pub. So, a real cruddy looking little kid. Darren looked kind of bad as a baby. He was bald. Darren is a baby, but like I am as a grown up. Not the groin. She couldn't hardly even wear those newborn baby clothes at say seven to ten pounds. Cam, good to see you, man. Good to see you, dude. I ain't been getting much sleep at night, and I'm kind of just. Well, this um, zombie eyes in during the day. Me too. This uh, 
thing I've been doing with the uh, allergies and stuff has made it really hard for me to sleep. So, in order to sleep, I'm taking NyQuil, which makes me half loopy until one or two. I'll tell you something I took one time and I, I didn't continue to take it. Was Tylenol PM? Yeah. You ever taken that? I think I have. But, you know, I, I said, you know, if you drink beer like I do, you know, regular, you don't want to be no acetaminophen. My monkey head! No acetaminophen. Yeah. No, no, no. No Tylenol. That the alcohol don't go good with it, that, so I thought, man, that stuff worked real great, but I, I can't do it, so then ibuprofen doesn't have that reputation to know with alcohol. Right, for, that's what I thought. No. Exacerbates liver. But I don't think ibuprofen, like Advil, I don't think they have a PM. Not the, they might have, I don't know. Oh, I think they do. They do? I've seen, I've like, seen, um, uh, uh, I've seen, like, uh, Shoot, what's the one? They'd be foolish not to have it on I've the market. Seen, I think I've seen a leave PM or, or, or whatever that is. They'd be foolish not to have it because, well, you know, golly, wouldn't you want to compete with that? Looks pretty damn good, don't it? Sure does. Okay. This pit right here, there was a garage sale over at the trailer park. Yeah. Many years before Grandma ever thought about leaving there. It was all yeah. I mean, was not too many years after she moved over there. Yeah. And uh, Look at you, it was in real good shape. Had the bottom part and all that. Yeah. What'd you get for it? A dollar? We're having a barbecue. I get 15 bucks for it, but yeah. you know, it's a craft, it's a Ken Oh, yeah. And, uh, you know, it was just yeah, we met, when we met Robert. Oh, I got some pictures of him. No, how oh, cool! No, I didn't meet him. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, I thought you but did. But these are all like snaps. Great, these are like great snapshots. Of a photographer that took them, and they were th throwbacks when I worked at Wolf Camera. Yeah, that's right. She's and uh, are they great? They're just yeah, those are killer pictures. Oh. He's like, they he thought he looked a little pink. Killer, I'm redone. Yeah. Just throw these away. I'm like, ah. Uh -uh. His name is Kim. <laughs> 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 It's the way it reads is don't do granny drugs, Sue. <laughs> but I think she said don't do drugs, granny Sue. <laughs> she got her pages typed wrong. That's don't cute. Do I like granny that. drugs. Don't do granny yeah. drugs. Yeah. It's too late. Oh, it's too late. I don't know what I'm talking about. I already had that granny drug. <laughs> Good oh, lord. These, these guys are like. Yeah. Oh. Like that hard. Like, like prison rape. Right. They program them to be little Nazis at school. <laughs> that's what I was doing. No. Aren't going in the photo album, but. <laughs> oh, our escapade. Baby. <laughs> I know. They got. Look at him. He's on his head right there. They're picking him up. No, you're this cute. Like no, you're cute. His feet came this way and hit the coffee table. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> that was good. Oh, sure. My back leg, right, buddy. <laughs> She thought that's funny. I'm the king of the I just got a big picture of them too. I ain't, I ain't, I know. Yeah, I ain't putting that in the photo album. Well, I did, but it's not There's funny. Their secret love affair. The Who's? Vio and Lewis. and Lewis. I don't know that it's very secret. They let it be documented on film. You got photos of it, you think. Yeah. Yeah, Just think what they do when they're off by themselves. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> now, what, what happens to Vio when he gets drunk is, you know. It's not. It's a. It's a pretty <laughs> Just picture holding your ass brother. and stuff like that. He starts drinking it. And of course, Lewis is like, you know, instead of like getting mad or ignoring him, he'll go the opposite way and go with it. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Next thing you know, they're really just slugging each other. I know. It's just. I think it's There's nice. a pricelessness to that. It's a pricelessness. Yeah, yeah that's priceless. It's like one of those things that. So it's really one of them, perfect. Whichever one of them dies first, the other one will be the only one crying at the funeral. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Which is something yeah. I thought of. That's pretty funny though. Oh, it's, 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 true. Funeral, it's, kind of thing. it's true though. Ice cream. They are yeah. like brothers. They do love each other very much. And then Obviously. <laughs> and Kirk's dating this girl that he brought over. 
We yeah. love having barbecue. Even though we went to high school, yes. none of us remember her. Are you happy, Mom? But she did yes. go. Go tell Daddy's camera what you just said. And she finally Dad, saw the flying circus. Tell Daddy. We love saw having Barba. All that. We love place. having barbecue. He's not sure about us. I know. Today. Say it again. What do we love? Yeah. Barbecue. Oh, she was so. Say it right here. Barba what? Barbecue. Barbecue. Uh, look, look, at, look at look at his face, Granny Sue. Look, look. Show, show Daddy's camera. Show Daddy's camera how pathetic you are. This is the only have to eat the ice cream we have in the freezer face. This is the only have two different kinds of ice cream in the freezer and can't get it from the She's ice cream man like face. That. She's flacking like that. She don't mean that. That ice cream. Hey, hey, Elizabeth, fuck it, fuck it, real mad about the ice cream. Fuck it, fuck it, real sad. Could y'all go play some music around the ice cream in the freezer? <laughs> could, you, could, you, could you, could you play some loud, tinkly music out the door of the van and sell them a little bit of ice cream out of the thing in the freezer, yeah. out the door of the van? We need some Monopoly money and a, and a music box. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, it. come tell John about, I mean, John, come tell Dad about the ice cream man. I wish you would get a shot of that. He just wants to go out there, he's running out there, and he gets, I just, he gets the ice cream man's attention. Because I had he's like, I'll oh, get it tomorrow! <laughs> I had to get some dry. ice cream. We have ice cream. We're going to have a barbecue. Well, me next week I'll have ice cream. You can have ice cream later today. We have ice cream. We already Daddy, have like I, purchased ice um, cream. Okay. Not so good. Do that when I do all this. right, all right, all right. This. We're gonna go in a minute then. In a minute, okay, John? Dad, can I have my? Can I tell the ice cream man what next week? You can tell him whatever you want to tell him. Ice cream man, he's got a certain way about him. He doesn't care. Mostly, probably drunk on the wheel. Mostly. Yeah, we, Probably we were uh, not English speaking. Reminds me of this is the other tape and one we ran out to get ice cream from the first But he can make good change, and that's Thank all we you can. Thank you, Shadow Timmy. Real old. Dude didn't really have a name, cool man. That's how out. long ago it was. I was like totally messing with the ice cream lady. Mm -hmm. You smell crack, Alice? Daddy, what is that little tune? I always suspect the ice cream man has a little something in the back for the older kids. What is that little tune the ice cream truck plays that y'all used to hear in the army? At least the one in my neighborhood. I suspect. I suspect he has. And I go running after the ice cream man. Something on a stick. Something on a stick. Don't do drugs, Granny Sue. Don't do granny drugs, Sue. <laughs> Show that sign, Glenn. It ain't important. It was just a. Hey! Oh, I can't think of the tune. Show, Show that sign. sign. Point to it. That says, Don't do drugs, Granny Sue. Oh, no, it says, Don't do granny drugs, Sue. I like the way you spelled Granny Sue's name. As if you're calling wild animals. At Sue! At least she says Sue, she don't say Ruth. <laughs> Granny Ruth. <laughs> John's been calling her Granny Ruth. All day or just that one time? He did, it uh, he did a couple of times. Close enough. <laughs> God, you're picky. <laughs> the child got the, the vowel sound right, if not the spelling. <laughs> you're funny. Hey, can you close that gate? Can you close that gate and latch it? I said, who do you know named Ruth? My grandma, my I grandmother's mean, mother. I no. said, well, do you, you don't know anybody named Sue? You, he said. <laughs> <laughs> it knows you. Good. That sure smells good. Like Come here, you. Come here. Hey, Come Darren. Yeah. Probably okay. so. Get me out. Okay, you. Come here, monkey. Come here. Oh, pick your legs up. There you go, baby. This is not a spider web. You're getting a little bit too scared of the spiders, honey. You're worrying about the spiders too much. Her name is Marina, which would be, I think, Spanish or maybe Italian. Marina, that's a girl on the floor.
I think those are the baby so spiders that were... Maybe. Or they're like all lesbians or are they five girls? I think those like... two girls on there. One Maybe is so. this girl that we're talking about, Jenny, who's experimenting slash bi. Uh, what other professions do they do? Like, what other their professions? Um, Bat, who was played by Jennifer Beals, uh, runs a uh, art museum, oh, contemporary cool. art museum. That's so cool. I've always said the L word. Um, <clears throat> the L word. You haven't watched that? The Showtime? Oh, it's a real good show. It's it's about it's like. Wang, do it. I saw one episode of Y'all's House. Well, the first season is on DVD. The first Edge. season's on DVD. It's just really well done. They do yeah. a really good job. And one of them is a tennis, like a tennis yes, player, right. who is now getting endorsements and actually starting a pretty good career. Yeah. It's well written. I've, well, from what I've seen and heard and read about. It's a good show. We really like it. Because you know, I heard that. Uh, you talk about. It. George Carlin calls the uh, constant certification. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, above the American Mail and stuff like, you know, Harley the, Davidson also, theme park. Also, you know, now they're, yeah, they're, well, they're, they're all coming down on the fireworks <laughs> thing now. What? Oh, yeah. They fireworks. Have, they've been doing it like, for a long time. You know, I mean, like hard, like they want to get rid of fireworks altogether. They're just running around. And not who are these people who want to do mean, that? I don't understand that. Not me. And then, what does Alice do, Glenn? It's like almost like there are certain parents out there who yeah, think that if they can just protect their children from all types of fear something? and pain, no, she that they'll grow up column, knowing about right, them right, anyway. Right, right. Uh, but you know what, Darren, I agree with you. There's right, no way, I mean, hello, we all made it. We didn't even have a car seat. <laughs> what? Mom, you didn't buy me a car seat? You had a car seat, son. I mean, you I didn't have a good wheel. It was called a seatbelt. I don't think I had one. Yeah. I, didn't I was going to say, you had a car seat. It was just like mine. It's got a seatbelt that went like this. <laughs> it across my neck. In between my parents, or if not, I would. My mother used to say that I would sit right, like my my grandpa. Now, if you hear the tires right screech, here, put your head, foot against the dashboard. <laughs> that was your car seat. <laughs> that was your car seat. Nobody wore seatbelts. Nobody wore seatbelts. Okay. I remember when I was Hold a your kid breath. in the seventies. Duck and hide. Duck and hide. Remember duck and hide. I remember that duck and cover. You know, Flash duck and cover, was it? Well, it yep. You know, it wrinkled duck my dress. I don't know. And cover. Or it was like all the way stuck in the seat. I took my driver's test when we came to Houston. The driver instructor was sitting over there, and I was in a Volkswagen. And when he told me to stop, I did like that. Yeah, there you go. There's a car, and car, had car, seat. There. car seat. For him to get in, I had to move the car seat on the passengers. Well, car seats were very different, though. And riding oh, bikes, they were like little plastic buckets. You know, Did they you weren't much of anything. Now no, they're just so the baby. And then they went to a period where a car seat was. I remember then we went to a period where a car seat was like 97 miles of stainless steel tubing. With crap all wrapped around it, and then pads and um, straps Will's and buttons and. Seat. Will's car seat was a little bit of molded plastic with a bunch of stainless steel tubing, and then a place where the seatbelt wrapped around it. <laughs> yeah, it was not much to speak of, and I believe it cost me five dollars. Well, that's because we got it at a thrift know? store, I think. But still, I mean. It's... He's alive, ain't he? I don't know. But, Shh. But we all had a fancy stroller out ever since my life. Well, my. Oh yeah, we got that. They, they stroller, got that, that shotgun stroller. That was a Cadillac. That couple that of training probably wheels. still around somewhere in my house. <laughs> we had that fancy stroller, but then we used that little cheapy umbrella type stroller. Oh, a yeah, lot more. Are a because lot it's more. much more convenient. The kids still strap well, the in there. Yeah, and the other one weighed about 100 pounds. You carry that thing around. Oh. <laughs> Get a hernia. But it does still exist. I got a hernia. Ah, ah, but I'm We used that. Well, this got me on Space alien is what that noise was. It sounds like the sound at the end of the one eyed, one horn, you know, flying purple people eater song. That's what it is. Play! Not yet. Not yet. Not on good. How you doing over there, Daddy? Don't have the strength to get in on these conversations. It takes lots of energy. He's busy. He's busy. He's got the burger thing going on. Oh, full on. Here we are. Well, that's true. We are very isolated. 
Sometimes my verbs and nouns even match. What is a verb and a noun? <laughs> <laughs> Like cat and she cow. Sure is You're now. bisexual and you ask that I'm mean, bilingual and you ask that question? A little bit of both. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> We're going to do some L word uh, <laughs> practice tapes. Um, yeah. Be careful, they get hey. the sound and camera. I know, right? <laughs> well, yeah, you, you, you work in the school system, don't you? They take you down. No, I'll tell you what would really be embarrassing is when your oh, kids grow up enough to understand what you said. Kidding? And we drag out these old tapes. Yeah, like, there's nothing on them. We're just around talking. Barbecue there because you know it could some child. Mommy, what did you just say? You know, get on the internet and they're in trouble. Who knows? But you always have the teachers, the two sets of teachers are always hanging out. Bedroom, looking at. Okay. Oh yeah, there's many of them. And then like at the school that I used to work with or work at, there was these two teachers. There were always. Always, always, always. Both well, about anything, they're getting bashed back by that family, so it doesn't. Yeah, really matter. I could play no you the positive tape. reinforcement in that bag. Well, it's meant to be joking, but after a while, enough. Yeah, it's. Pretty I mean, it's cool. just the whole. Anything that has to do, and I said it then. Anything that has to do with Uncle Gerald. Any people were around Uncle Gerald. We were busting. There's him going on to. Oh, I was busting his ass. He said something to Kelly, and I hit him hard. You saw how hard I hit him. Yeah, it's just me. I mean, he, is, he said something. My man talks about it like this when he talks, he's like a this. And he's just like, I just don't even know how you can stand it out here. It is Dude, hot. it's so hot. I can't. I mean, really? Oh, great. Come on, I'm take my picture right when I'm blowing my nose. Oh, my God. I mean, really. I mean, I got it on video. I was like, okay, son, just be all that you can be, son. You get on out there and you put that wig on. He really would be good as a drag queen. He would be good as a heavy drag queen. Hi, John. How you doing, buddy? Good. What are you up to? I'm just gonna, just gonna stand up here. Okay. Well, you're doing a good job of it. Yeah. I hear a train. I hear it too. Do it some more. I want to film you. But John might get in the way. Okay, John, you do it. Hi, baby. All right. That was good. Thank you. Very well done. Supposed to guess that. Oh, that's uh, there's something that happened on a camping trip. I'd get a photograph of that if I had a camera. I have my digital camera with. <laughs> you could take pictures with my digital camera and use your. This obviously doesn't exist anymore, and you probably want to have it later on. What? What'd you say? 
It wasn't meant for me to take any pictures today, obviously. If you go to try to look for your camera, you won't find it. Okay. So you just uh, don't worry about it. There's no need for you to be like that, Darren. I love this. Oh, it's bizarre. Because then it's perfect for Darren. This thing is perfect. We need to put one on our patio, babe. Oh, not here, I though they tell you that. Papa Ray? No, I don't uncover it, John. What? If you uncover it, I'll just have to cover it. Where are you going with? Kirk, Don't Kirk. uncover it. I just have to cover it all back up again. We were gonna, Kirk was gonna bring us. It's so nice, cool. Tina Messina does not like hanging out with the flying. Rain tonight. Did you get this video? Video, better watch them out. Oh hush. They might end up together married. Camper. Well, if they are, then they are. Say that again. <laughs> what did you say? Say it again. What well, they are, the well, they are. Well, if they are, then they, they are. are. <laughs> London, England? Yes. Oh, London, England. That's the hotel. That's the real hotel room that we stay in. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I haven't seen your England pictures. <laughs> no, she's like, oh, it's this one. I'm like, okay, women know that guy's yeah. like that. Yeah, right. Yeah, and it was really cool because then, then he puts he's it like, on. He fixes for it, me it takes a section of it out, and, and, it. and nails it all back together, and then gives it to her, and she puts it on. She's like, oh, that's so much better. I thought she was being like nice. No, it was perfect. Months later, I find out she wasn't just being nice. She really loved. It was cool. I mean, you're paying for this service. This is the classic. And he was just such a great. This is that classic sh scene where, uh, where they were in American Rule in London. They're around the, uh, the fountain there. The oh, the that was so good. It's also where the World Hide and Seek Hide and Seek Championship started. That's yes. actually. Uh, that's actually. Uh, that's right. No, it's Bogger Square. Leicester Square. Uh, Leicester Square, Square is where the lions are. Here we are in Leicester Square. We yeah, rode sure by right. in the bus, but didn't get off and see it. Didn't well, I would have to like get a something of me standing there and I stretching. Yeah, I know. I getting ready to do the World Hide and Seek Championships. Yeah, I, I got a list. Of I did these eight times. Do. My favorite shot. In Soho. Isn't the color great. I handheld that. I leaned up that. against the wall and handheld that. Look at the girl's leg and the guy talking to her, and she's like, "It's called her lace girl. Something. The Soho Cabaret." It was really cool. I'd love to blow these up real big and see them. Yeah, I, that one would be cool. Look at your two sick bastards. Kissing. What? It's Bush and Saddam. 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 Kissing. Kissing. Well, you are eating again. Yeah, you constantly eat. I swear eat. you got like three times a day y'all eat. Yeah, we so ate a lot. Okay. Out here, we got our luggage and we go in there and we're just like... You don't have to just okay, smile at it room, constantly. We're like, I'm scared. I want to go home. <laughs> it was a little bit of like... Like culture shock I'm trying to make it show my teeth. Like <laughs> Sit back and rock. Rock. It was just wretched. And I'm like, oh my god. That's an adventure though, really. Yeah. You have to sit all the way back. This is a battery station. This is that was the exact angle of the uh, Pink Floyd Animals album cover. That's the building on there's a big floating in the air. Flynn might recognize it. Sweet Lord. Stop.